Welcome to Wings of Arrow Advanced Education and Research Organization. To know more, visit our official web page www.wingsofarrow.in. Now we are going to learn about how to find angle of attack of NACA 2412 airfoil. Consider a NACA 2412 airfoil with a cord of 0.64 meter in an air stream at standard sea level conditions. The free stream velocity is 70 meter per second. The lift per unit span is 1254 newton per meter. Calculate the angle of attack. Consider NACA 2412 airfoil. Cord of an airfoil C is 0.64 meter. Free stream velocity V infinity equals 70 meter per second. Lift per unit span L dash is 1254 newton per second. Now the question is what is the angle of attack? To find angle of attack we must know the dynamic pressure. Dynamic pressure is the increase in a moving fluid's pressure over its static value due to motion. It is defined by Q infinity equals half rho infinity V infinity square. Where V infinity is the free stream velocity, rho infinity is the sea level density. We know that standard sea level density is 1.23 kg per meter cube. Substitute rho infinity and V infinity values, and solve. Thus the dynamic pressure for the given airfoil is 3013.5 newton per meter square. The lift coefficient then expresses the ratio of the lift force to the force produced by the dynamic pressure times the area. We can write CL equals L dash divided by Q infinity into S where CL is the lift coefficient, S is the span of airfoil, we can write S as cord. Now substitute the values of L dash Q infinity and cord, and solve. Thus we get lift coefficient CL is 0.65. We need angle of attack. From the shown graph we can obtain the required angle of attack for CL 0.65. Thus alpha is 4 degree. Did you know? In space the skin on your feet peels off. This is a pretty gross fact but in the microgravity environment, astronauts are not using their feet to walk. Therefore the skin on their feet starts to soften and flakes off. As laundry facilities do not exist in space, Astronauts will wear the same underwear and socks for a few days. Those socks then need to be taken off very gently. If not those dead skin cells will float around in the weightless environment. Space is not that far away. Space officially begins at the universal marker of the Kármán line. This invisible boundary is 100 kilometers above the Earth. In theory if you could drive your car upwards, you could be in space in less than an hour. The hottest planet is not the closest planet to the sun. Even though Mercury is the closest planet to the sun, it is not actually the hottest. Mercury does not have any atmosphere meaning that this planet is only hot in the daytime when it is directly facing the sun. At this stage temperatures can rise to 425 degrees Celsius, but at night the planet's temperature can drop down to a freezing minus 180 degrees Celsius. Venus is the hottest planet. Its thick clouds trap the sun's heat causing Venus to be a sizzling 500 degrees Celsius all of the time. If you have further inquiry or requested video, Drop down to our mail wingsofarrow at the rate gmail.com. Don't forget to subscribe for more updates. For the time being, take care, stay blessed, inspired, and fly high.